bound to be. A, a I got few, my whopper. So. Mine's at? charging. How about, how about you? Wop. Mine's charging. You, you're supposed to wear it while it's charging. Charge the battery. Wait. Do you I, it's charging. Right now. Put the strap on. Alright, I'll show you. Yeah, it charges oh, where it, yeah. I unless you. you're charging the charger. Mm, get it. There you go. Okay. Yeah. What's well, the first time I've ever done it like that? That's pretty fancy, right? Yeah, you never you literally never have to take it off. You're supposed to just you become... And you better not ever. <laughs> you goddamn well better not ever. Better I'm not ever. Really upset. Better not ever is a weird sentence. Better not, not ever. ever. There's, I mean, there's, it's just there's a better way to say it. Better not ever. Mm. Okay, how? You should never. That's terrible. That's not nearly as like Im imposing. Doesn't have the same emphasis. Yeah. You should never do this. <laughs> you're like, you know, fuck you. I'm gonna do it. But if I'm like, you better not ever do this. You're like, oh shit. There might be consequences. Like, I bet you never take that strap off now that I said it the way I said it. I bet you very, don't. That was very imposing. Yeah, I didn't like it. So, yeah. I got yeah. a little bit of a new perspective. <laughs> I guess not yeah. a new perspective, but a newfound respect, I guess. Like, talking to you about it, and then whoever else was... That it, it is Mortal Kombat. Like, what do you expect? It's Mortal Kombat. Yeah. That that being said, the movie still could have been better. I think, not necessarily the plot was lacking, but just the movie overall. I don't know. It felt. It definitely left a lot to be desired. There wasn't a tournament for God's sake. Yeah, I mean, you you name it Mortal Kombat. There's no fucking tournament named Mortal Kombat. Don't and is I, there like, fighting I, at all? There's fighting, yeah. There's some pretty cool fighting. Okay. But, but uh, it's it's it feels like a prequel almost. Like, don't make me watch your movie to see the real movie a couple years from now. The I think the thing is they're banking on it to be mm -hmm. really good, so yeah. that people are like, please give us a sequel, and then the, and yeah. then people are like, ah. <laughs> it's not super great, yeah. <laughs> but like I said, like I said, like I told I told Josh that if you were going in here, if you're going into the movie expecting it to be anything more than a Mortal Kombat movie, you're yeah. gonna be disappointed. Yeah, the acting is not great. Yeah, the main character is really shallow. Not that's, a fan of the main character. That's weird to me that it's 2021 and we've still got blockbuster movies that don't have great acting. Yeah, like how is that still happening? We've been around for 2,000 years, and we don't have one good Mortal Kombat I movie. <laughs> I feel like we're, we should be beyond bad acting and, and big budget movies. Mm -hmm. That's not, yeah, that's not uh, untrue. Dude, put me in Never, there. not better. Don't ever. Let me, let me be, let me be that dude. I'll be you dude. I mean, you probably could have been that guy. Mm -hmm. No, Which I could have been. The main guy. Cole, Cole the, the, the character they made up for the movie. Oh, that's mm -hmm. dumb. Now, now I don't. Now I don't want to see it. I didn't it. like that though. I didn't like that they made up and added a character for the movie. Especially yeah, why does when his powers fucking suck. Why does he have to? Why do we have to have a character? There's enough of them. Mm -hmm. Hey, yeah. There's enough of them. Pick one. <laughs> <laughs> or don't. It doesn't have to be yeah. about a yeah. character. Don't introduce a a new character if he's not going to be dope. <laughs> Here's our also, Sonic yeah. the Hedgehog movie with our main character, Todd. God. <laughs> I mean, there's, yeah, there's like 20 Mortal Kombat characters. Todd Why make the a new Hedgehog? One? I think if Todd you count Hedgehog. like three, there's way more. Uh, there was a web series that I think was better than... Uh, I never saw than that. This. I never saw that web series. Yeah, uh, apparently it wasn't terrible. And then, you know, there's the first movie, which I think people just like, you know, Based on nostalgia, mm -hmm. and then the second one was just sad, like it was yeah. just real bad. It's poop. Um, it, it's it, poop. it was it was poop. Um, this one wasn't like it wasn't terrible. I just didn't dig it a whole ton. I guess. Yeah, I'm not. 
I'm not happy that I watched it. <laughs> I'm probably not going to watch it again. I'll never I have watch a it again. Deep seated regret that I'll probably never I'm o- get over. I'm okay that I watched it, but I'm not happy that I watched it. That's for sure. Uh, that reminds me of when I'm um, asked, or I'm sat Ryan and Lydia down, and uh, we watched Hereditary. <laughs> Mm-hmm. And uh, Ryan texted me the next day and said, uh, "I wish I could unsee that movie." <laughs> and that, wanna, I think um, that was that was the sorry, first no, time. No, no. That was the first time I'd ever heard somebody say that as like as far as it goes of not liking a movie, mm. they wish they could unsee it. Did he um, not like it, or did it scare him? And he wish he hadn't watched it. The the it scared him. I think both. I've heard that one's good. I haven't watched it though. I keep meaning it's, to. But. It's rough. I would recommend it though. What I would what I would highly recommend <clears throat> is actually I got, I got cock blocked uh, this week by this show, um, but Invincible, Invincible is so good. But they're doing this thing now. I, it feels like we're going back to regular TV, where there's block episodes. There's only seven episodes right now. I have to wait tomorrow yeah. to watch the new one. Mm. And it's yeah, like it was that. it it was the cliffhanger, dude. It was like the episode of episodes and I didn't realize I'm like behind everybody. So I watched it and I was like, Oh yeah. Episode eight comes out Friday. No, yeah. No yeah. I don't understand way. what that's about because the whole thing for me with Netflix and stuff is that I can binge a season instantly. Yeah. And yeah. Mm-hmm. it's the whole appeal to me when I, when I watched like Dexter or lost or whatever it is, when certain episodes would end and I was just, I'd be mad that they designed it that way when it was on TV. Like I'd look right. up and be like, yeah. if I had, if I, this was real life, and I had to wait a week to watch the next one, I'd lose my goddamn mind. Tell you to suck it, yeah, yeah. I, I can't handle it. And now they're doing, now they're working their way back to that. I feel like, yeah, I feel like maybe they do it to keep your interest. But I feel like I'm more <clears throat> prone to lose interest if I forget that I've been watching a show for a week. Yeah, you know? like WandaVision was a mistake to do it like that. Because did they really, I didn't know they did. At, it like that. Yeah. Oh well. Any Disney Plus show now mm-hmm. is in blocks, especially if it's a big one like WandaVision mm-hmm. or Winter Soldier or uh, Mando or any any show that's come out on Disney Plus. Now they've made it a weekly thing. I hate and it. with so, WandaVision, like with WandaVision, you just like each episode you get this cliffhanger, you, like big cliffhanger of like something's going on, but you gotta gotta wait a little bit to. I will say, with Mandalorian, I almost appreciate it because they don't do that. It felt like there wasn't a cliffhanger. It was each episode was concluded, yeah. and then you get a, ne- a next a new episode next week. Mm-hmm. So Mandalorian wasn't that bad, but yeah, if y'all have, I know that Jay, you don't watch a lot of TV, but you should definitely take the time to watch Invincible. It's really good. Okay, I'll check that one out. I think I'm just a miserable person. <laughs> We were watching Bob's Burgers the other day, Taylor and I, and uh, Teddy and uh, what's the wife's name? Linda. Linda. We're at the uh, shop, the burger joint restaurant, and and Bob was out doing something, just complaining the whole time. And uh, Ted and Linda were having a great time, and I was like, "You're John, or you you and John are Ted and Linda, and I'm I'm Bob. I just hate everything. <laughs> I, it's just, I'm." It's just instinctual. I'm prone to hate things. Who's Ted and who's Linda? You and Ted. <laughs> no. Oh, me. Oh, I thought you were talking about me and Jonathan. I did too, actually. Yeah. No, Taylor is Linda. Okay. okay. John is and I'm Ted. Te- I'm Ted. Teddy. Teddy. How do you feel about Teddy, by the way? As a character? Mm-hmm. I like him. I He's hate fine. his goddamn guts. I hate him so much. Because he's a he plumber, He drives me up the dick? fucking wall, man. This guy hates plumbers. <laughs> this guy hates blue-collar workers. How dare you? He hates these cans. Do either of you know that? I still that don't quote? get that. I still don't. I still don't. I've never seen that movie. So stop doing that. What I'm movie is it? I'm never going to stop. The Jerk. Oh, Steve Martin. Man, the fact that y'all haven't seen The Jerk is... Actually unacceptable. I don't do that much. Like mm-hmm. if you haven't seen a movie, The Jerk, you have to see. You well, have is that the to one, fucking see it. It's is got that the one Steve where Bushimi, he says I was Ethan Hawke. Um, wow. And does it? Marilyn All star Marilyn. ensemble cast in The Jerk. <laughs> Denzel <Yeah>. Washington. 
Ariana Grande. Isn't that the wow? Ariana Grande. Isn't that the one where he was like, "I was porn, uh, porn. I was born a poor black child." Yeah. Okay. Have y'all seen the guy on TikTok who does Denzel? Because it is Maybe. insane. It is. Is so that the guy good. with the dreads? I don't think so. I don't think he has dreads. He, mm, he might. I don't think he does. But it's dude. It's it's insane. He, it's, he it has sounds the, exactly like Denzel. The mouth. You know, he does the mouth. Yeah. Sure. Really good. I've never seen anyone do it better than Jay Farrow. It's mm. better. That's wild. It's better than Jay Farrow. It is really good. Okay, it's I'm crazy. I'm going to have to see it. You have to yeah. send me a clip of it. I won't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Look it up, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I hate Teddy a lot. Did you guys see that uh, Elon is hosting SNL and people are freaking out about it? No. Why? Because people are fucking bored. I don't know. People... I mean, just any opportunity to get upset. I, I guess because he's rich. Wait, they're mad? They're mad yeah. that he's... They're mad why? that he's hosting because he's oh. rich. I would have guessed it was because of his, like, moderately, like, conservative... Like, some views, of the... Uh, some guess, of the cast was even... like I think A.D. Bryant maybe tweeted something about, like, the wealth imbalance in the country. Like, oh, the top 50 people... In the, the top 50 richest people in, the, in America own more than the bottom half. Of the kind, or some shit. Like, what are you talking about? How many like, people have been on SNL? I'm right. And, and because Elon. How many is, of them weren't rich? Yeah. yeah exactly. Like, exactly. It's, it's so weird. So weird. He's picking shoes. Huh? Super fucking famous. I mean, I guess it makes sense that 80. What? 80 Bryant got mad because I don't even know who the fuck that is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, so he's, he's hosting, and then Miley Cyrus is a musical guest. Cool. And he tweeted something, and she, like, quote, tweeted it, kind of playing around with him. Mm. And everybody got mad at her for associating with oh him. For gosh, hanging out, man. like, hanging out on Twitter with him. Yeah. Good God. It's like, what in the fuck's going on, dude? I guess yeah. I'm going to have to uh, keep not watching that stupid-ass show. <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's, not, it's not funny anymore, is it? It has its moments still, actually. I'm sure, there's yeah, I'm sure there's stuff. parts that are funny. But... Weekend Update is almost always good. Oh, uh, yeah, of course. Uh, and then... um. It has its moments. It's, you know, uh, Keenan still kills it. There's a couple yeah, people on there that still kill it pretty regularly. Um, I, saw, I saw, who the hell's Addie Bryant? <laughs> yeah. I, you know who that is. Yeah. Uh, I saw, I did see a clip of, a, I don't know if it was a recent weekend update um, about them making, what's the, what's the white guy's name? Colin Weekend. Up- okay. They made him read something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they made him read something about Martin Luther King. <laughs> yeah, so what they do, I think they do it on April Fool's, like the, whatever the weekend is around April Fool's, they joke swap. So Michael Che writes Colin's jokes, and Colin mm. writes his jokes. God. And Michael Che just always makes him say the most racist <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and then Have he'll s- tweet, like, cancel Colin Jost. Like, he tries to get him canceled. Gosh. Have y'all seen the one where they... Uh, maybe it was that in- incident where they uh, he had a joke about um, his wife. What's his wife's name? Scarlett Johansson. Black Widow. Scarlett Johansson. Did yes. y'all see that one? Where he had to, he made a yes. joke about somebody looking like Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> Colin Jost is married to Scarlett Johansson? Yeah, isn't that wild? Good for no. him. No. Colin Farrell's niece knows Addie Bryant, who used to tweet about Elon Musk with Scarlett Johansson. Mm-hmm. Cool. Uh, so there was another one where Seth Myers. It was the same kind of thing where uh, they were talking about the COVID vaccine. Some about uh, it, basically writing like a racist joke for him, and he's like, "Oh my god, why did you make me say that?" Mm-hmm. It was uh, it was about the <laughs> it was about how a bunch of uh, how the COVID vaccine is being distributed to more like black communities so now the covid vaccine comes in grape (laughs) (laughs) dang that's pretty funny and he immediately looked over and was like (laughs) (laughs) that's so fucking dumb Oh, I mean, because I mean, it's on the prompter. You're gonna read it, and then you and then you don't have time to react until you like, because that's what that when they when they did Charles Barkley dirty by uh, making himself call himself a, a dumbass. Mm-hmm. 
just oh, right I in the middle that. of all the yeah. I gotta see that. Go yourself, San Diego. <laughs> That's what I yeah, thought about exactly. as soon as you said it. If it's on the prompter, I'm gonna read it. <laughs> Name one person who doesn't like Anchorman. I'll shoot him right now. I don't think I can. Good. They would deserve it. You just saved a life, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like Anchorman, let me know in the comments below. Go ahead. You also, if you're mad state. about Elon Musk being on SNL, just shut the fuck up. Get, get the yeah. fuck over it. Like, that's so annoying. And then, like, the the responses to Miley Cyrus's quote to Devin was like, don't associate, you're better than this. And like, like don't tell me who the fuck to talk to. Fuck you. <laughs> like, people are so entitled. I was having a conversation. They shouldn't feel entitled to. Yeah, I was having a conversation with uh, somebody the other day and perfectly describing to me what I what I thought was you have one side who's worried about their own, like what's going on in my household, my family, and then you have another group of people who's worried about what's going on outside of their control. Mm. Like the people who are worried about who who's on SNL, the people who are worried about who Miley Cyrus is hanging out with, if mm. Daniel Craig is wearing a, a bippity boo or whatever that thing is, you know, well, he like, better not be. Worry, worry about just worry about your family and your household, you know. Do you, boo? Mind your business. Yeah, if you're so mad about who she's tweeting, unfollow her. Unfollow her. You or don't get the fuck off to Twitter here. to begin and with. Sh- like, shove it up not- your butt. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Sit on it and spin. <laughs> yeah, piece of garbage. Yeah, yeah, people are weird. I just I don't understand. I feel like people are making Elon this polarizing figure, the bad guy. Yeah, and he's really he's had a couple of moments that maybe weren't great looks. You know, he called that dude a, a pedophile a while back. But I don't know. Maybe he knows something we don't know. You know what? I, I but feel like, like I he's, can see. Elon being a villain, though. He looks like he could pass for a pretty good villain. <laughs> he's Well, he's also got the backstory of a comic book supervillain. Yeah. He's the richest dude in the world. He's innovating all this technology. <laughs> he's a he's mastermind. Got, he's got all this shit we don't know anything about. Yeah. yeah. He's, he's, like, getting his fingers into everything. You know, Starlink, he's going to give the world free Wi-Fi, and he's sending shit into space. And, like, it's yeah. all, the foundation's there. Like you know I'm just waiting on him to fly through SNL. New York on a Green Goblin hoverboard. <laughs> get, <laughs> yeah, yeah, get him off SNL. They're right. Addy, and see, Addy, Bryant, get him off. Here's what's wild about it is like, this seems like the buildup. Like, mm-hmm. he's set to host SNL. People are freaking out about it, like making him out to be the bad guy for some reason. And it's like, he, now he goes on SNL and he's like, you want me to be the bad guy? Oh. Yeah. And just like, like flies. Yeah. <laughs> he's good. You know, he's got a jetpack down his pants or, or something. He's just... <laughs> <laughs> or just like throwing teleports. bombs into the crowd. Tele- yeah. Oh God! <laughs> I mean, Starlink is gonna like what was it? Jim Carrey, Riddler, everybody, but everybody has one in their own home, and they're gonna mind control. I forgot us. about that. Yeah, oh it's all God. it's all there, man. It's uh, it's all building up to this moment. I'm, I'm I hope he does it. I'm excited for it. <laughs> maybe I'm maybe of, everybody else knows something we don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of mind blown. We're living in a comic book right now. Yeah. Wow. We Turn very well page. could be. Turn May the page, 8th. God. <laughs> <laughs> Bring on what? Elon. That's so bad. <laughs> That's so fucking gross. <laughs> what? Uh, what's Elon's villain name, though? Captain Tesla? <sighs> no, Tesla? it can't be Captain. Captain is too, like, uh, heroic. Mm, heroic, yeah. S- Tesla Link? Link? Professor or Doctor or... Um... Yeah. Dr. Tesla? That's a good villain Joe. name. Oh, that is kind of—it's kind of got a ring. Yeah. All right, that shit and busting. You, oh well, okay. We made a few episodes. <laughs> that sounded like a like an audio clip. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about that the shit neur- busting? It's like Neuralink or something. It's the it's the chip he's he's wanting oh, to make. Oh, where uh, yeah, the monkey was playing pong with its mind. Yeah, dude. How do no, you feel about that? No, that's not real. No, it's real. That didn't happen. Look it up. He's an evil genius. That's Dr. Tesla out. says different. <laughs> I'm t- <laughs> Everybody's like, I'm not, I'm not getting that. Put that shit in me now. Yeah. That's, that's, Put it in me. Put something in me. <laughs> that's where I want to be, dude. That's, that's why I want immortality. I'm so nosy. I want to see where, like how far technology gets before it's too far. 
I want to be yeah. here when the shit hits the fan. Put that chip in me, dude. Put whatever you want in my house. Put that chip in me. Let's go. I'm, I'm here. Cyborg me the fuck up, dude. Uh. <laughs> I am all about it. What happened Give me the just, let me Goog- just let me Google that. it real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Jonathan volunteered for that chip in his butthole. I love that you uh, I ain't seen look like you were like weeks. scrying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, have y'all seen the um I told I think John, we've talked about this. The the guy who does the um little device right here that makes you see in three D. Have you seen that? Oh, this where was, it makes his eyes like this was years ago, but yeah, it's like this little like probe or something you put right here, it's got electrodes on it. And his eyelids start going. Yeah. Brrr, yeah, 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 yeah. Brrr. We have to back up a little bit. I'm confused. We, what do you mean when you say see in 3D? That was the concept, is that you can... Wasn't it like you didn't have to have 3D glasses or something? We already see in 3D. No, talking well, about like like on a screen. Like a screen. Oh, like watch a 3D movie without the glasses. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Except for his eyes were going... Yeah, his like, eyelids were see- like opening and closing. <laughs> it, was, it literally starts off, it's like tick, tick, tick. I was like, no way. Wow, this movie's amazing. (laughs) Yeah. Man, his eyeballs got to dry the fuck out. Pause it, pause it, pause it. You got to send me this clip. I got to see this shit. (sighs) Yeah, it's been a long time since I've watched it. But, um... (laughs) I forgot about it until you mentioned it. Make it stop. <laughs> I can't turn it off. It's got blood running down. Yeah. Ooh. Eyeball just pops out Dude, straight up. That's like that's like my like never want to happen. Like like And it doesn't take me. much either. Dismember less me than five pounds out of pressure. Eyeball. Five pounds? Yeah. Mm. I, that used to, I was I was terrified of that for years. That was one of my To like scoop it a, or pop it? I mean what like, the fuck are you gonna do out? about it? Oh, okay. Like imagine like F this, dude. That's this is. The I mean, you just got to get past your eye socket, and that's it. Yeah. Imagine, imagine Fruit. this is what yeah. this is what you can see of me right now. <laughs> the worst. Well, actually, you'd be seeing like you'd be looking down with one. You could you could see your feet with one, and then be staring at the screen with the other. Is that how that works? <laughs> like it's dangling. Yeah, it's dangling. It's swinging. Chris and I do the running it's joke of. Uh, I think it's Rock, <laughs> Rocky Three, where Mickey's standing there. He says, "Tell me when you see it." He goes. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> we had a Shih Tzu when I was in high school, and you know, like when you're petting a dog and you like to like do this to their head. Yeah. Pet, mm-hmm. and, and I was doing that. The and they, were like, be, yeah. they were like, "Be careful doing that with him, because you know their eyes are already bugged. Or like if you pull his ears back too far, his eyes will pop out." And I was like, "Okay, <laughs> I'm never gonna touch this dog." Yeah, don't let me touch to- it because I'm gonna try it. Yeah, no, I didn't want to do it. You animal! <laughs> you like, I just monster. thought it was like hands off because like you got me curious. No, then I was scared to touch his ears at all. I was like, I don't know how far is too far. Like his eyes already kind of look like they're hanging out. <laughs> oh my god, dude! Like a it's like a pug. A pug's a little deformed, nasty animal. I've seen them with their eyes popped out, and it's a wow. regular thing for them. Yeah, like when they bark too hard. Yeah, like if you're gonna have a pug. Expect to go to the vet Just a few times. To put it out of its misery. In. Don't have a pug, you sick animal. That or open his nostrils up because they can't breathe either. Yeah. Just don't get, like, stop. Don't get them. Well. Unless it's like a the, rescue. That's like human, like, playing God at its finest. Like, we we've, we've, we bred pugs. Like, we made that. <laughs> Good job, America. <laughs> Look what you did. <laughs> The pugs should be on our flag. Are they American? For sure. <laughs> the pug should be on our flag. Jesus. The pug is our is our country bird. Just freaking <laughs> this this dog right here. Oh yeah. You What's your state bird? The trim? pug. <laughs> the pug. Is there a bird? Is there a bug called? Or is there a bird called the pug? No, the dog. Oh, the, the dog. <laughs> but we said state bird. Yeah. 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 It's the pug. <laughs> Get over it. That's Welcome to I'm Iowa. Doing. What's the... Yeah. Yeah, Iowa for sure. Dude, I did, a, I did a quiz the other day of like, click this state. And it's a blank map. And it's like, click this state. <laughs> click this state. Iowa blew my fucking mind. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's like, it's a little like... 
quiz to see how well you know the states. So it's a blank U.S. map. Oh, And then okay. on your mouse, it'll say, like, click Missouri, and you click what you think is Missouri. And, and I thought oh. Iowa was, like, over here. <laughs> like, over here with Ohio and shit. Oh, it's, it's, no. Tu- it touches Oregon. Yeah, it's, like, it's pretty, it's left. <laughs> I thought it was, I, I, I've never cared less about anything than Isn't Iowa. Isn't it, like, right, right near, like, a, I would have guessed above Nevada. I think you're region. right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, buddy at well. work. <laughs> <laughs> My I buddy know Tennessee at work. Tennessee the touching states. Uh, almost couldn't point out New York in a minute. So. Mm. Mm. Well, to be fair, New York is like. Isn't there like seven states in this little like vicinity? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Seventeen. It's awful. No. Um. <laughs> buddy at work's girlfriend's family lives in Iowa and he said it was probably the worst drive he's ever uh been a part of cuz there's n- literally nothing there. Yeah. I had a dude when I was in the army uh joke with me about being from Tennessee and he was from Iowa. Oh. Was like well, well like <laughs> man, you really haven't gotten around much, have you? Yeah. No one knows your state's real, dude. Congratulations, you have the <laughs> Slipknot album. That's it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is a real statistic. If you're from Iowa, your IQ is less than 90. That's 100%. Mm-hmm. Like, not to be offensive, that's just real facts. It's like a biological thing. Yeah. You know, Slipknot and corn, not the band, the vegetable. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't think anyone from Iowa and has... Neither one of the band. Like, actual Slipknots and corn. <laughs> oh, God. Did you know that people from Iowa don't can't see the color blue? Yep. They don't yeah. deserve to. That's the crazy thing about it. It's weird. Yeah, really weird. It's like, it's justice. <laughs> Natural justice. <laughs> this is what you get. I think they also bred the pug in Iowa. <laughs> <laughs> name one good thing that ever came from Iowa, though. I no can't. one knows anything about it. Name, name one city. Name one city in Iowa. I don't even Boise. know how to spell Iowa. That's Idaho. I fucked up already. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Boise, Iowa. That's not right. Isn't their capital a... Iowa City? Probably. probably. And it's probably the only city. <laughs> it's just probably as Iowa big city. as the state. <laughs> <laughs> just what, are you just fucking mute? <laughs> Sit here for the rest of the episode with his mic muted. <laughs> <laughs> I heard dog that. Barking, his dog barking in the background and the I'm baby out. monitor. She's just like. <laughs> this might be a little far, but I think I'd be okay with bombing Iowa. Okay. Is Jesus. that too much? Christ. No. Okay. No, I'm with you. Is it too maybe, much? Maybe that's where Elon will head first after he flies hey. out of the studio on mm. May 8th. You know he's got a bunker in Iowa because ain't nobody going to find it. Yeah. Iowa. I feel like I could name a city in every other state. Oh, I was I was about to look up the capital of Iowa. Hold, please. Fontaine. That's Des Moines. That's going to be my guess. Oh, yeah. Shit. Des Moines. Yeah, yeah. same. I was like, oh, God, yeah. That, I knew that. <laughs> Dang, we've been ripping on Iowa. I forgot all about Des Moines, dog. <laughs> Everybody's... Been- Everybody's been watching this sitting there going, Des Moines! <laughs> Des Moines! <laughs> I'm going to try not to even fly over it. But that's... Can I speak to the captain, please? <laughs> yeah. Just one second. I feel like we're headed uh, like sh- over Iowa. It's not going to work. <laughs> Detour. I'll pay for the gas. Don't worry about it. I mean, it's a big possibility co- that you could never... Can you... Do you... Does the airplane use gas, or is it just... You have to call it fuel? You call it Gasoline? No, or is I it think technically it's gas? I think it's probably, yeah, it's probably not gasoline. This is 87. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all got high ethanol or like low? <laughs> <laughs> Takes them like six days to fill it up at the pump. <laughs> <laughs> it's, for the, it's for the airplane. Don't worry about it. Damn, Just you go, fly. Go around. There's another pump. Go around. <laughs> go around. <laughs> Your plane doesn't use premium? What the fuck? <laughs> Get that jank-ass plane out of here. Was that plane from Des Moines? <laughs> mm. Bro, I would love to have a plane. There's nothing I hate more than driving in the car. I took a vow a couple years ago that if it's more than 
was it three hours? I don't drive it. We will not drive it. I'm and, I'm uh, over driving. When I was younger, yeah. I used to like it, and then I drove back and forth to Georgia all, several all times. All the time. And, yeah. We took so many road trips as a kid, yeah. and then even Till and I have taken trip. Like we go to Florida, like feels like three times a year. Um, and I'm just I'm done. I'm not doing it anymore. Yeah, I'm so. So if I had my own plane, bro, ooh. Give me it. Give me my own plane. I might buy a plane now. That might be my next investment. <laughs> <laughs> I know two buddies. I have two buddies who know how to fly them. I'm getting a plane. End of the episode. See y'all later. <laughs> You're going to get a plane and have them you did fly to me. <laughs> <clears throat> What'd you say? I'm going to what? You, you're you going to get a plane and have them fly it? Mm-hmm. You don't, you don't want to fly it yourself. I don't know. I have to go to school and get licensed and all this other stuff. I mean, stuff. it's basically like driving. Not if right? it's your plane. That's the law. That's you a good idea. Yeah. I am you sick just... of the government telling me what I can and can't do. If I own the plane, I'm going to fly it. Yeah. Yeah. Wing it. <laughs> Man buys plane, dies same day. Yeah. That's what you would <laughs> Drives into a wall. <laughs> Never, Never even gets it off the ground. Off the ground. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> yeah. Just a seven car pile up on the mm. expressway. Yep. Seven cars in your plane. <laughs> I bet flying a plane is really... I was going to say it's not that difficult, but there's a lot of buttons. Yeah, you don't use most of them, I'm sure. I, I was going to say, I'm I think sure. you use the same four or five buttons, right? Gotta be. All, all I need to know how to do is speed up and slow down. <laughs> get the landing gear up, I'm good. Yeah. I don't dude, need I used to know play the shit out of a flight windage? simulator when I was younger. Windage? Nobody think. needs to know what windage is. Fuck all that, dude. I'm going, I'm going up. And then Fuck I'm wind. I'm going up. <laughs> I'm going up, and then I'm going right. <laughs> up. Go down. up. Down. That's it. Avoid your feet like this. That's and there's it. no traffic? I'm like, fuck no. that. That's easy. Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> 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 Gotta watch out for gooses, but that's about it. Hmm. Gooses. How about in the Jetsons? Um... You know how the, there was like still traffic and shit. Is that yeah, we're not, else we're, not, me? we're not ready for that, though. I mean, you have to have airlanes. You can't just can't be a free for all because then it well, would. Then be what's ton- the fucking point? But then there would be tons of accidents. If, if everybody's fl- that'd be like if there weren't lanes on the road. Everybody's just driving around. There's going to be tons of accidents. You got to have rules. Well, Jumping. on the ground, you can't, you can't get just different live elevations. In chaos. Sure, there's a different level. There's a different dimension to it, but I still think you got to have some type of order. Like in Jetsons what? times? Mm-hmm. Jetsons times. I don't like that. <clears throat> well, there's our time. And then there's, there's the Jetsons t- time. There's <laughs> Jetsons time. <laughs> Flintstones <laughs> times? Our <laughs> times? Jetsons times? Hard we live times. in 2040 JT, okay? Gosh. <laughs> All right, let's synchronize watches to Jetson times. Yeah. No, we're on Jetson time right now. Uh, definitely don't want to hear my dog talk. That's 100%. Why? What? I don't know. And also what? I feel like they're plotting. Jet- Did Leroy a- Astro? Talk? Astro. Leroy? Astro Where did I get Leroy from? Yeah. I think you were thinking Elroy. Elroy. Is a dog in Jetsons can talk? Yeah. No, he says like no. I don't, I don't think. Does so. Does he say rut row? I don't is, know. Is that, is that, that all he says? Is rut row, Rorge? I don't. Oh shit! Yes, Rorge sounds familiar now. <laughs> <laughs> the Rorge did it. I don't know what. I don't it know. Did, what's it did. Right. <laughs> it it woke the memory up. <laughs> this man said. I mean, no, if your did. dog looked at you and said Ronathan, you're not going to be freaked out a little bit. I'll be mad. Yeah, that's not his name. Yeah, do better. What if? <laughs> what if Uther could talk, but he only called you John? <laughs> Is that a deal breaker? Like I don't want him to talk anymore. He he has full vocabulary, but, but... always calls you John. <laughs> I could I could probably I'd probably let him get away with it. Yeah, I let Ryan but get it, away with it. But every time under your breath, he's like, "That's not my fucking name, stupid I know. dog, <laughs> bitch." After after what I did for you, you little son mm. of shit. <laughs> it's Jonathan. No. <laughs> Just defiant. Yeah. No, it's not. 
<laughs> yeah, just telling me I'm wrong. Yeah. <clears throat> Dude, here's a fun one. Here's a fun one. How tall are you? 6'5"? No, you're not. <laughs> Standing in front of me. No, you're no, not. No, you're not. No, you're and my not. favorite exchange of that is, no, you're not. You're six. You're like 6'7". Six, and I, <laughs> nope, I'm not. I'm 6'5". No, my brother's 6'5". And you're taller than him. Like, well, your brother's not 6'5". Or you're eyeing it wrong. <laughs> like, how you gonna so, ask me? I've been this tall for years, dude. I know how fucking tall I am. How tall are you? 6'5"? Oh, hell no. No, you ain't. Just, no. uh No question mark. No, you ain't. No, you're not. Where do people, where do you get off? <clears throat> no. Don't tell me how tall I am. Or when I introduce myself to someone, Jonathan, and then they go, John, mm. well, what'd I say? <laughs> All you gotta do is say back the thing I said. That's it. That's the only requirement <laughs> of you here. Got me cookie, got you cookie. Why would you immediately shorten my name? I mean, I'm not gonna me. lie. I like, I am, I'm a fan of like <clears throat> saving time with shorter words. I do like why, that. Why use why more use word when big, fewer yeah. word do trick? <laughs> you don't, okay, you don't do... like Joshua, right? Mm-mm. I go by Josh. Why? Why do you, Josh. Do, you, do, you, do you have a reason, or is it just the so, way it is? This is weird. When I was a when I was a kid. Oh man, I was gonna say. What'd you say? I was gonna. I was gonna tell say, this you tall bastard. Um, when I was a kid. I went by uh-huh. Chase. That's my middle name. So everybody called me Chase. And I was like six or seven, maybe. I was like, Mom, I don't want to be called Chase anymore. Chase is a kid's name. And, uh, <laughs> it's, but instead, I wanted to be called JC. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. I was like, I don't want to be called Chase anymore. I want to be called JC. And my mom was like, no, nah, that, dude. I'm not oh, calling you JC. Yeah, that is really bad. <laughs> so I'm so glad that didn't stick. It just, uh, just it was just Josh. But people will do that. People, I've had people come into the office. They're like, oh, is Joshua here? And I'm like, you bitch. Did no, no one ever said Joshua to you. So, yeah. It's frustrating. How about you? Do you, do you? Why do you prefer John over your, your full name, which is uh, John Cran? <laughs> what? John Cran? <laughs> what are you... You sound like, like, uh, what's his name? Jonkran. <laughs> you sound like, uh, Jackie Chan in, uh, Shanghai Noon. <laughs> Ch- Chun Wen. John Wen. Chun Wen. John Wen. That's a, ca- that's a terrible that's cowboy name. That's a terrible name. cowboy name. That's a terrible cowboy name. <laughs> Those movies are so good, man. Yeah, they are. Yeah. They are. What is that stupid impression that, if you don't feel bad about every ant you've ever stepped on, you're an animal, and I love it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck was that? That was my best Owen Wilson. Okay. There's no way that's your best Owen Wilson. I mean, I don't practice Owen Wilson. I just that was off the cuff. Wow, wow, that's pretty good. There you go. That's a, everyone immediately knows who that's that all is. You need. Yeah. yeah, it's the De Niro face of of oh, vocal God. impressions. Yeah. Mm. Do it. <laughs> it's the you hand. Do, you got to do it's the knife the, hand. Yeah. You. I got nipples, Greg. You. <laughs> uh. I watched um. Taxi Cab Confessions for the first time a couple Wait. years ago. <laughs> With Robert De Niro. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah. Robert Taxi De Niro driver. in Taxi Cab Confessions. <laughs> Taxi it. driver. It's a pretty good movie. It's an interesting episode. <laughs> uh, it's a pretty good movie. I don't think... You talking to me? Yeah, I don't think it was like... For me, it wasn't iconic, but it was a pretty good movie. It's pretty good. Have y'all seen it? I don't it? think I've seen it. I don't think so. Uh-uh. Not all the way through. It's, I've seen I've good. seen like the, the big like moments of him like staring in the mirror with the... He has like a slight... Like a... Um, Sliding rail, like from a Chester drawers. Mm-hmm. Chester the, drawers. Chester, Chester, Chester drawers. Chester's, Chester's drawers. Chester's drawers. Uh, <laughs> uh, and he was doing the whole "you talking to me" thing. He's got that damn thing in a Chester drawer. Chester drawers. 
<laughs> you know, I don't think I, I haven't seen a lot of the old classic, um, like older De Niro movies. A lot of those, a lot of those big ones that everybody thinks you should have seen. What I, De Niro or not, but like the, like Scarface and, and Goodfellas and, and all that shit. I, I said Goodfellas. the other movies, not just the ones he was in. Oh. I'm talking about I'm talking about those movies. I, yeah, I no, haven't I'm seen Scarface sure. either. With Robert no, he De Niro. was he was in Taxi Cab <laughs> or Taxi Driver, whatever. Stop calling it that. <laughs> Taxi Driver, sorry. He was in that, and he wasn't in another movie until Meet the Fockers. Uh, did he do... Sh- that, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Don't look it up. I've heard you can take too much and be unhigh. I just... I, I, then I took another one. What the hell? You're gonna overdose, you idiot. Didn't do... Oh, I'm gonna overdose <laughs> on the marijuana. Sorry. Uh, Don't try it at home, kids. I, it didn't do nothing. I must have got a dud That's or something. Really you know I was real funny? mad. <clears throat> I've never understood that don't try this at home. Where else am I going to try it? Yeah. In your backyard, depending on how dangerous it is. I would say backyard is still home. Sure. <laughs> don't try this in your house. Don't try this inside of your house. Don't, yeah. don't try this at home. Joke's on you. I'm going to do it in my yard. <laughs> <laughs> Loophole, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> We have reason to believe you were doing drugs in your home. Nope, maritime law was in my. <laughs> you thought wrong, Ma- maritime law. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Does it count if my feet are on dirt? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really dumb. Um, maritime law. I guess uh, I don't. I guess talking about gummies or something reminded me. I, I made um, Evelyn a peanut butter and jelly earlier. I love. Peanut butter and jelly, dude. I could eat you like do. seven you're, if I were you're high. Really passionate about it. I love peanut butter and jelly. What's do the you, jelly though? Do you like more what peanut flavor? butter or more jelly? Oh, um, there I is think a wrong I like answer. more jelly. Ah, see, you're you're. you're ooh, almost. Ooh. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> what the fuck were you gonna say? I was about to get us canceled. <laughs> Great. Uh, I can't wait till this is over so you can tell me what you were going to say. De- <laughs> definitely go more. <laughs> I the fuck? I, like, oh, man. I mean, if you prefer I, more jelly, you know what you are. But. Jesus Christ. I don't know. I don't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you definitely got to get more peanut butter, dude. <laughs> Like, it makes the, like, the when the bread sticks to the roof of your mouth, it makes that way worse, though. And you have a bunch of peanut butter. John, peanut butter or jelly? Which one? Which one I gotta more? go even. I gotta go even. even I gotta get the okay. nice. I gotta get the I, nice, even Yeah, I think I prefer even, even, but if I'm going more of one than the other, I think I'm going more jelly. That's weird, man. John, you're a square, dude. <laughs> Are you gonna call me something else? <laughs> No. What kind of jelly? That's why that was my question. <clears throat> no, I just asked that question. Strawberry. Strawberry's um, a good one. I got nothing against grape. Strawberry no. fucking goes ham. It's just so Blackberry's <clears throat> too that's too much. It's too much there's too much flavor in blackberry. Uh, I've had a peach that's pretty good. That peach raspberry. marmalade or whatever. Oh, raspberry jelly on a peanut butter sandwich. I don't think I've had that. Well tighten what about your a marmalade bottle, dude. Marmalade on a peanut butter sandwich, though, is... Have you tried it? No. <laughs> but you can't do it. Marmalade on a peanut... Ch- what the fuck is wrong with you? I've never had it, but God, you, what a fucking idiot. If you I'll have. tell you what goes hard is a peanut butter and marshmallow cream sandwich. Oh, a fluffer nutter. Oh, a fluffer nutter. Oh, a fluffer nutter. That toast, motherfucking thing's bad. toast the bread and a little bit. if you ever say it to me like that again... <laughs> um, we're gonna have a goddamn problem. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fluffer nutter. Fluffy oh, nutty. there's a name uh, for it. Oh, there's there a blessing. A fluffer nutter. Yeah, you gotta toast the bread a little bit though. It's your blessing. Sure. Do you put? No, uh, I don't want to toast the bread. Don't. Oh say that. yes, toast the bread. No, don't toast the goddamn bread. Yeah. If you're watching right now, toast your bread. If you don't listen to him. Uh, a recommendation. Mm-hmm. Put a little bit of honey on it. Yeah, what like doesn't honey go good in? Dude, really. Like Maybe actually. spaghetti. Okay. 
Like I mean, maybe, maybe. maybe. Like yeah. savory? <laughs> Have you ever tried it? <laughs> it's like Did cinnamon chicken, on a hamburger. Chicken nuggets and honey, bro? Yeah. Wow, chicken, how good chicken, that is. Chicken, yeah. Sweet and savory. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't know about chicken nuggets and honey. Like McDonald's chicken nuggets and honey? Absolutely. That sounds disgusting. They're fire. That, that's the best chicken nugget to put in honey. What are you talking about? Ch- you were so fucking dramatic. Shut, that's the best shut up. chicken nugget yeah. to put in honey. Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> I'm not dramatic, number one. Number two. <laughs> B, you never... <clears throat> you gotta go chick like quality chicken if you're dipping it in honey chick fil A. I mean, you yeah, go real Chick fil A nuggets are good, but McDonald's nuggets go real are chicken. fire. McDonald's nuggets are fire, and it is and the you, best nugget to dip in honey. Have you ever dipped a no, McDonald's nugget in, if, hun- in honey? I ate a McDonald's nugget the other day and literally threw up outside my mouth. <laughs> you're full of shit. I, there's just no way around. Yes. I they, love the face after you said. <laughs> <laughs> he tried so hard to be natural. <laughs> well, people the most say unnatural I've, I've ever seen him. People throw up in their mouth. I threw up outside of my mouth. He because said, I, I threw that. up outside of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, they're so gross. They're almost that's, as bad as... That's crazy to say. They're almost as bad as cookout chicken nuggets. I haven't had Because cookout chicken nuggets are like putting vomit in your mouth. They're disgusting. They're sick. <clears throat> But I feel like they're probably good if you're hating on McDonald's nuggets, though. No, no, no. You know they're making they're making honey specifically to like dip your nugs in, uh, like Chick-fil-A hot ones. Nugs? No, hot ones has a nugget honey that has like pepper mm. extract in it. Okay, that sounds so, delicious. But if you think Sean Evans is eating McDonald's nuggets, you, you got be correct. Coming, <laughs> I bet no. he does. I, I bet, bet he, he doesn't. Does. I bet he. I hates bet he them. fucking kills a ten piece, bro. I wonder if he's just like a sloppy human being outside of that show. <laughs> Why? <laughs> like wears nothing but sweatpants and eats chicken nuggets all day. Sounds like the life. Yeah, give, me from, that, give me that fifty piece and a jug of honey, bro. And Let's he's go. from Iowa. A jug <laughs> a of honey. Jug. <laughs> I will drink honey straight out of the jar. I'm not fucking around with you guys right now. <laughs> I will do it. We, you know the little teddy bear with the yellow cap? Yeah. Often. You know what's... I pop that and just stand there yeah. for like three minutes often, while it works its often? way out. Uh, often? Well, not as often as I'd like, but maybe more um, often than your average person. So, I do that like to coat, like to coat your, like if you have a sore throat, I've always heard like honey, like a spoonful of honey. I will almost gag. Which is uh, really weird because honey's, honey's good. Like a that spoonful of honey, it will make me almost gag. I think it's like the thickness of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, it makes me hard, so.